Welcome back, everybody. Today's show is all about camping, and, and you know it's all about the food when it comes to me and camping, especially some great fish. There's nothing like um, a great fish right after you've caught it. So here to tell us about their brand new cookbook and give us some tips and recipes with uh, cooking fish um, from the DNR, we've got Mike and Candy. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. Hi. So first, we're going to get this uh, fish on the grill, and we'll kind of start there, and then we'll tell you how we got to this point. But right now, it's in a wonderful. A maple uh, a soy sauce marinade, and we'll show you how to make the marinade in just a minute. But Mike, you use one of these baskets when you do the fish. Yeah, it's nice to hold it together. Okay. Otherwise, it'd fall apart. You know, when you're flipping it, yeah, so it it's is, nice to hold it together. Bit, it's a little delicate, yeah, so especially right. certain types. So these sure. baskets are great to invest in. So, yep. how long has it been in this marinade, by the way? Overnight. Overnight. Yeah, okay, I did so it we're really going to get some nice flavor. Oh yeah, definitely. Does that kind of take away that fishy flavor? It, 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 yeah. Okay. The maple syrup, yeah, it Make gives it a nice, it up. yeah, Ooh, right. I think my daughter would be all about that. Okay, uh -huh. so we'll go ahead and put it in. Okay, so I'm going to so coat. oil it a little bit. Yeah. Just vegetable oil? Yep, vegetable oil is okay. fine. We'll do both sides, of course. And those things are pretty inexpensive. I'm thinking yes, you can get they them are. anywhere. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. I love fish on the grill, too, because um, it takes that fishy f smell and keeps it out of the house. And uh, it also gives it some great flavor. So basically, this will hold three nice fillets. Yep, I trimmed them up so they would Perfect. fit nice on there. Oh, and sorry, we got to pepper them too. Oh yeah, we can pepper them. I like pepper. Yep, you betcha. So lots, lots, lots of, pepper. of pepper. I lots like pepper, pepper too. Lots, Amy. Okay, all right, Mike. <laughs> He's the boss. He caught the fish. I'm listening to him. Okay, there we go. Then we're gonna close her up. Yep. And there's no. I don't have a clasp on it, so okay. it's just over the edge. Okay. Right. Make sure. And it doesn't have to seal all the way. Okay. It's not a big deal to okay. leave it. And we're going to go uh, flesh side down. Okay. Flesh side minutes. down to start with. Yep. Okay. Okay. I love this because you don't have to worry about anything because sometimes the skin sticks and it's just a big right. mess. So, all right, we're going to shut the grill and we will talk to you a little fishy later. All right, now, um, first of all, Mike's going to take us through now. Um, when you catch a fish, whether it be a salmon or in this case, this is a trout, right? A brown trout, yep. Um, Caught from Green Bay. Very cool. It's yeah. um, and so <laughs> gonna taste really good, I imagine. So you, you got this. It's out of the water. What do we do right away? Get the old fish fillet <laughs> knife first, out, huh? First thing that's done. I mean, we it's already been gutted. Okay. The gills have been removed. Okay. And now I'm gonna slice her up. Okay. And he says he could do this in one minute. I'm like, are you serious? <laughs> sure. So we're gonna slice just behind the head. Okay. And then come down to the vertebrae, and then you got to be careful with your fingers, of course. And then you just give it a nice, you're cutting right through the ribs, and then down. Wow, you make that sides. look so easy. Amy, you want me to do the other side? Sure. Sorry, fork, please. I'll take the ribs out. So I like to do with, uh, to hold the fillet so mm -hmm. it's not sliding around is I'll stick it. Okay, with the and fork. Just yeah, to... just kind of hold it, otherwise it's sliding around, okay. right? And then you go right underneath. And that's going to get the bones out? Yep. All those rib bones out. Because that is what, I, I mean, I love fish on the grill, but I don't like those little pesky, those, some of those bones are so little and I don't, you don't want anyone choking on a bone. No. And it doesn't have to be perfect, you know, and the, uh, the belly meat's going to be thinner, right? So you don't have to go all sure. the way. When you grill fish, a lot of times you leave the skin on? Um, yes, when okay. you grill it. Yep. And when I smoke, I definitely leave, leave it on. Okay. Okay, you want me to do the other side? Well, while you're doing the other side, yes, go ahead and do it. Uh, okay. Candy, you tell us about this cookbook. We have a new cookbook. It's online. You just go to dnr.gov and search for Eating Your Catch. And what we have is a, a number of recipes that highlight different species from Wisconsin waters. And in the cookbook, we're, we have some tips for how to uh, cook your fish in a healthy manner and obtain uh, some of the health benefits um, from fish. We recently tested fish from Wisconsin and we uh, quantified how much of the uh, omega-3 fatty acids different species of fish have. And omega-3 fatty acids are um, a benefit to your health for cardiovascular and developmental They're benefits. good for you. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And fish is one of the primary ways to get that in your diet. So there you go. Uh, again, how can people get the cookbook? You go online to dnr.gov okay. and go to the search bar and then you type in eating your catch and then on that web page you'll you'll see a little icon with this cookbook um, healthy dishes with wisconsin fishes how much is it it's free online Ooh, free. You just, it's there a you pdf go. it's a pdf or a, a flip book 
and so you can just print off whatever you want, Love you it. know, whatever recipe. Um, like I said, it's got different uh, fish species from lake sturgeon to bass, um, gar, a number of different uh, species of fish that you can catch in Wisconsin. Very cool. I love that. Okay, so Mike, we're going to get back. Look at this. He said he was going to get this done in like a minute or two. You are the man. Yep. I'm going fishing with you. Yep. It's gorgeous. So we're going to make a quick marinade, which works really well with salmon or this trout. Um, and this is this maple glaze um, yep. that you let it sit overnight in the fridge. So right. maple syrup. Yep. About a cup of that. A cup of maple okay. syrup. So that's yep. a, yep. I eyeball And could you hand me the whisk over there? And then if you want, this is just the basics, is putting, and then it's a quarter cup, sorry. Soy sauce? Soy sauce, yeah. We don't measure a lot. We just kind of eyeball it. It's what all going to work good. So you got the sweet and the salty here Correct. going on. Correct. And I love to use the real Wisconsin maple syrup. We make some great maple syrup. Yep. And then some lemon juice. Yep. Teaspoon of lemon juice. Fresh, of course. Fresh lemon juice. So. And there we go. And we Whisk just take it up our a fish. little bit and uh, flesh side down. Okay. If you wanted to make a little alteration on this, you could put some fresh ginger in there. Ooh. Great fresh ginger. Oh, in there. yeah. Be a different. Oh, that would be really yummy in mm -hmm. here. And really best to sit in there covered. At least four hours. Four overnight. hours or overnight. Yep, correct. And then uh, get it out and get it on the grill. Let's check this baby. Probably ready to flip, you think? Yep. And it goes quick. Here, you need a nope, towel. It's, there. it's already, you can see, and you don't want to overcook it. I mean, that's the key with seafood. Correct. Oh, yeah, definitely. Wow. So Three about minutes on each side. Three minutes on each yeah, side. Yeah, especially so if it's quick. a thinner fillet, yeah. Wow. So this is just about ready to come off. Yeah. So we'll close the grill. Yeah, what are we making next time, minutes. guys? We're going to make some bass. Ooh, we're going to fry. We're going to yeah, do a little fish fry, fry. Wisconsin <laughs> fish fry. Yep. All right. We'll be right back. Uh, lots more ideas when it comes to camping coming up, so stay with us.